Hello, and welcome to drillingcontractor.org. I'm Kelly Ainsworth, here at the 2016 SPE Hydraulic Fracturing Technology Conference in the Woodlands, Texas, where Weatherford is highlighting its T-Block Shore Temporary Diverting Agent. Here to tell us more about this product is Andrew Babby, U.S. Technology Manager for Weatherford. How are you doing today, Andrew? Good. How are you, Kelly? Doing well. Could you give us a brief overview of this product and how it works? So T-Block Shore is a particulate diverter, so basically we're mixing two different mess sizes uh, to create an impermeable plug or as much impermeable as we can we can get a hold of. We're mixing two mess sizes to get a to build a plug at the near well bore to divert fluid to other unstimulated zones. Uh, when we first thought about this product, we did it for more the refracking application, but lately it's been taking off in the new well applications for better zonal coverage along the lateral to make sure we're placing propit and fluid all the way throughout the stage. What are some of the stimulation challenges that this addresses? So like I mentioned before, when we're, we're looking at zones or we're looking at stages within uh, some of these long horizontals, to drive efficiency, we really want to be able to stimulate as much in one stage or one pumping stage as we can. So uh, by, able, by us being able to take, in, take those stages and make them longer, by, but still getting the same kind of prop and concentration and stimulation in each of those individual perf clusters. In the Eaglefort, what we did, we've done two pretty successful studies. The first, we looked at using the in-stage diversion to just increase efficiencies. So basically we took a normal frac design that the operator was already pumping, added the T-Block Sure agent, and we came up with about a two, uh, just over a 200% increase in their initial IP rates. Uh, the next really key study that I think uh, we're highlighting here is looking at some of the, the frac hits from, off, from offset wells. We feel like with the diverting system, we're able to shorten some of the fracture half lengths so that we don't have some of the detrimental frac hits to the offset wells. And in that case, they were actually able to stay out of some high H2S zones, so saving the operator really a lot of money and a lot of time. And thank you for joining us today and giving us a close-up of this product. Thank you. And thank you for joining us on drillingcontractor.org.